Rick, it's no secret the west side of Louisville has an ongoing problem with gun violence. Park Duval is one of the areas impacted by shootings, but folks we talked with say life on Beach Street is usually quiet and safe, or at least it was until this afternoon when a man was killed. When I come outside, I'm like, dang, look how life changed like that. Travis Robinson is originally from Georgia, but has lived in this house on Beach Street for about a year now. Yeah, this is a nice street. We got good people around here, good neighbors and everything, you know? So, like, like saying, seeing this on this street is not, not nothing that you would see all the time like that. What he saw happened just across the street. Police officers, detectives, and crime scene investigators going in and out of this house, where a man was shot more than once and died. Now, LMPD is asking for the public's help in the search for suspects. Any information that helps us, helps us bring closure to families, bring closure to communities, uh, helps us get answers and, and lock people up. LMPD's homicide unit is handling the investigation. Police didn't indicate a motive or events which might have led up to the deadly encounter. The name of the man who died will be released by the Jefferson County Coroner's Office in the coming days. Back across the street, Travis Robinson spoke these words, which summed up the scene he witnessed from his porch. No, life happens in a heartbeat. And that deadly shooting in Park Duval earlier today marks the 111th homicide in Metro Louisville this year. Reporting live in the studio tonight, Randall Cam, WOKY News.